Welcome back guys. So today's instructional video, I'm going to show you how to assemble all of our different wheel kits. So as you can see, each one here is an example of what comes in your wheel kit. We have two bearings, two precision shims, and a hex nut is what you'll most commonly see. Now there is an exception for our smooth idler pulley kit, which is also going to consist of our plastic bushing, as well as an M5 25mm screw. But mostly, the assembly is pretty straightforward. I'm going to go through each one of these wheel kits and show you how to assemble them so there's not going to be any confusion of how to assemble these wheels. So let's go ahead and get started with our Mini V Extreme Wheel. So we're going to take the wheel shell, take one of our Mini V bearings, pop it into the face, flip it around here, take one of your precision shims, place it in the middle, and your additional Mini bearing is going to go on the opposite side. And you're going to snap it into place like so. So that is an assembled wheel. So your additional parts here go into uh, another part of the assembly, which would be to your plate. So let's move on to our mini solid Delrin V wheel. Once again, take one of your mini V bearings, pop it into the face, flip it around, precision shim, and your additional bearing. And that is the assembly for our solid Delrin mini V wheel. Now moving forward here to our large Delrin double V wheel. Same process, we're going to take our open builds bearing, which you can see is larger, and place it into the face. Our additional precision shim, you know, place in the middle here, and close it into place with your opposite bearing. And that is the assembly of our double V wheel. Alright, so moving forward to our, our metal double V wheel. So this is an awesome design. So we're going to go ahead and take one of our bearings here, and place it in the top face. And if you have any issues with putting the bearing in place, you can find a flat surface and pop it in like so. Taking your precision shim and placing it in the middle here and your additional bearing and then pop that into place. And that is the assembly for our metal double V wheel. Moving forward we're going to our solid Delrin V wheel. Once again bearing in the face, add your precision shim and your additional bearing and that is the assembly for our solid Delrin V wheel. Moving on to our extreme wheel which is our large extreme wheel. So once again take your bearing pop it into place and add your precision shim with your additional bearing and that's the assembly for our extreme v-wheel moving on to the smooth idler pulley wheel so this one's going to differ a little bit guys so we're going to take our smooth idler pulley shell we're going to pop one of our bearings in place here we're going to flip it around add our plastic bushing you're going to place that in the middle and close it in with your additional bearing and then from there you're going to take your 25 millimeter screw and run it through the middle of the smooth idler pulley. So if you have any issues with your plastic bushing not being aligned, you can simply take one of your ball drivers and shift that around. That way we can get our 25 millimeter screw through, just like so. And then from there you add your precision shim and your hex nut will lock on to the opposite end once you've mounted this to a plate. All right, so that's the assembly process for each one of our wheel kits. I hope this helps guys. Definitely subscribe below. There's more instructional videos coming out every day, new build videos. So keep up to date guys. Make sure to subscribe and we'll see you next time.